Okay, hello y'all. Um I'm so pissed off right now. Um I did a video with Dawkins Aromas, Candy and Neroli, and I deleted it by mistake. And now I gotta go all the way back through that video, just trying to make memory for my phone. But anywho's I just got this order in today from Dua. This is from April 26th. Um, you're seeing these two little samples right here because um, those were the two from Dapper that I smelled. And I do have a video I'm attached to this doing a wear test that I also went and bought um, Burberry Goddess from the Travel Spray from Sephora for $40. I'm not sure if it's in that video. It might be. Who knows? But I got these months ago when I first started ordering from Dapper and um, decided to go in and play around with them. Uh, Byron Mula Mula, I did do a video. It should be up that I did a uh, layering with that scent and I really liked it. And then Burberry Goddess, um, I really like too. Again, these were scents that I got from Dapper months ago um sometime uh maybe fall 2023 somewhere around there as you can see um this is gone it was really good i loved it so i will insert that video into this um doing these i believe it's these two anywho um i don't know i saw that Dua carried it. I do like Dua fragrances. So I went and bought the Dua ones, Goddess Within Her, and Two Shot Caramel. This is uh, Mula Mula, Double Caramel, and then this is Bird Baby Goddess by Dua. So, um, hmm. Let's spray this. I sprayed it once. Um, okay. Do I still do have these in stock? It's 129 available. It's, um, floral food, fruity gourmand, denotes of caramel, ginger, peach, raspberry, strawberry, vanilla, amber, laochin, oud, and patchouli. It's unisex. It's $55 for a 34 ml, and they do have it in stock. I did spray this earlier. My memory is going. And so I had to go in and clear out some things just so I could get this video done. I'm just trying to see what I smell. I'm getting a spicy from this that I don't think I got from um, Dapper's. Let me spray this. I still have a little bit left in here. Okay. Let me see. I don't know what the um what the OG smells like um of uh Mula Mula Double Caramel. But do that uh, dappers. I like much better. For some reason, from Dua, and I don't know which one is closest to the OG because I don't have the OG. But dappers, I'm getting a sweet, you know, scent. Like I said, it'll come out in the video that I placed before this. But in Dua, I'm getting a real, like, that patchouli, I think, is what's coming through on this. And I don't like it. Mm -mm. To me, it's giving patchouli heavy. Yeah, this is going to go to my husband. I think I'm going to have to go back in and get the one from Dapper. I ain't getting no raspberry, strawberry. All I'm getting is probably oud and patchouli. Oh, well. 
I'm sorry for my um mood, y'all. I really am kind of, I'm tired, first of all, but I am kind of pissed that uh, I have put so much into that video. And I have to go back and do it again. Hell, if I can even remember what the hell I even did, to be quite honest. Um, I'll look through my phone and see if I could kind of, if I could find it. I hope I could. Anywho, I don't like that doer's um two shot caramel. It's giving me too much. Spice. Let me see. Let me see how it smells and when I put it on my skin. Okay, we're gonna go to the next one, which is um cotton candy milk. That is a new scent he dropped on that day, the 26th, the 26th. Y'all know I'm a sucker for anything cotton candy. And so I went on ahead and um, ordered it. I do have two of these. Um, and of course, it is sold out. Anything that's going to say cotton candy and milk. Um, <laughs> it ain't going to stick around. So basically, it's out of stock. It's a Dua Fragrance Original Blend. Welcome to the gourmand world of milky notes of our latest drop, Cotton Candy Milk. Imagine yourself strolling in the garden and suddenly whiffs of cotton candy capture your senses. Let me put this up there so y'all can look at it. Um, what did I, You will be excited, right? This is exactly what this fragrance smells like. The scent starts with cotton candy, smothered smoothened by milk the fragrance has a whimsy cloud delight vibe due to the noticeable the notes of vanilla the subtle undertones of musk provide noticeable elegance to the scent kind candy milk is a partial a portal to a world of fragrance fantasy it's a gourmand notes cotton candy milk vanilla and musk is unisex it is uh sixty dollars for the 34 ml so let's see if this gonna give what it's supposed to give I'm hoping I smell some cotton candy in here, not just milk, like that French macaroons and milk. Oh, y'all, that smell good. Oh, my. Are you getting that cotton candy? I'm glad I picked up two of these. You getting that cotton candy? And then cotton candy, some cotton candies are berries. And sponge sugar and all of that. And some are strawberry. I'm kind of getting a strawberry. A strawberry vanilla. You do smell the milk in the background. The vanilla and must kind of smooths it out like it says. But I'm getting a strawberry-ish sugar um cotton candy yeah this is nice okay do what you kind of really redeemed yourself with this one i think as it dries down the the electronic note the milk comes through a, a lot more it's kind of like a creamy strawberry or creamy berry mm-hmm We'll see what it morphs into as it gets older, but I do like it. I will say, if you don't like milk or like tonic, this may not be the cotton candy for you. Because you do get that milk heavy, especially as it's drying down and it's morphing. Mm -hmm. Yep, you do. But it's nice. Let it sit some and we go from there. Let's hope this goddess within her is, um, I'm liking because the double caramel moolah moolah. I don't know about that. It ain't jiving with me. 
goddess within her is inspired by goddess by Burberry. Again, the first one I smelled was Dapper. Um, I really did like it. I compared it with the OG that I had bought the travel size from Sephora. Um, I didn't really, the Sephora one was nice. It just wore down quickly and it wasn't as sweet. The Dapper one definitely was better to me than the OG. I have not smelt Dua's, but I figured you can't mess it up. If I liked uh, one dupe, I should like the other, which is a lie. <laughs> I mean, Moolah Moolah is starting to be okay. Like I said, let me let it sit. Basically, Goddess by Berry, a vanilla perfume with character and much personality is what you will find with Goddess within her. This latest inspired expression opens with a dulce and delicious vanilla ingredient that melts with flavorful cacao for a rich and inviting gourmand experience. Vanilla caviar creates the originality in the dry down while aromatic lavender graces us with its presence. Goddess within her is a perfume truly created for a goddess. This heavenly gourmand composition is exceptionally versatile irresistible and it will leave behind an unforgettable siage be sure to claim your bottle of this latest inspired expression today classification is aromatic notes are vanilla lavender cacao ginger vanilla caviar and vanilla absolute gender is feminine so this is this is not for y'all guys i'm trying to see um uh, trying to find a, a paper I'm going to spray it in the air and the paper. So this is my first time smelling this from Dua. Okay. You get that lavender for, for sure. Very, very pretty. You get the lavender. Um, the vanilla absolute. Um, is that like a? I'm not gonna say. Maybe more perfumey. I noticed dappers being a little bit more sweet. I'm going to spray this on my um, arm. Let's see what I get from it. I noticed Dappers was a little bit more sweet. As you can see, I don't think nothing else is spraying out of this. From uh, Dapper, I literally... <laughs> I'm getting a little bit. I literally used this up spraying myself down during the wear test. You can smell the vanilla starting to come out on top. I'm getting lavender. Lavender mixed with that vanilla. I'm not getting much cacao. I'm thinking cacao chocolate. You definitely get lavender, vanilla. The vanilla starts to come through more so on as it's drying down and morphing. I do think Dappers is more, has a more sweet, like the vanilla, all of the vanillas in it. I believe with Dapper is coming through more. And that's what I liked about it. But Dua's is not far behind it. And I would say once it, it starts to mature, the uh the vanilla probably will come out even more being that it's so many vanillas in here you got vanilla vanilla caviar vanilla absolute 
And also too, uh, Dappers has been sitting for some months um, in my little bag that I keep all of my samples in. So that could be as well, again, with all of the vanillas morphing together um, is why uh, probably Dapper is doing a lot better or more sweeter. So we'll see, um, but it is a pretty scent. I'm not a huge lavender <laughs> lover. I never have been, but um, I can tolerate it. And again, with all of the vanillas and just coming through, I think it would do better over time once it starts to mature. But I can add some, um, when it comes to my body care, um, some sweet vanilla it, uh, type body creams and oils and spray this over and it'll give me my life what I'm looking for. So I have hope for it uh, with uh, Dua's goddess within her. But um, yeah, that is about it. Um, I didn't order anything from Dapper this past Friday. Um, I started to, but I was like, no, you don't really need anything. You got so many that you have to use. But basically, this was my duo haul again. Um, I doubled up on the goddess and the cotton candy milk. And yeah, that two shot caramel, I am not feeling right now. Um, maybe it has to sit and morph and mature a little bit more. But that patchouli... With my skin, any patchouli, cedar, with stuff like that, it will, um, it will come out the strongest on my skin, and I don't like it. <laughs> I mean, it's okay. Yeah, it, it it's okay. I might have to go back to Dapper on their on their double double. I mean, Moola Moola. Let me see. Let me, I still have some dapper left. Let me see how this stuff smells. Okay. Let me see if it's giving me the same thing. Cause I know I did a layering with this and I was like, wow, this is, came out so good. But again, I've had dapper for a couple of months now. Yeah, see. Dapper is much better. I'm getting that caramel. On Dua's, that patchouli, boy, that patchouli is wearing, rearing its head. But on Dapper's, mm -mm. I'm getting more of the caramel. Um, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, on dappers is, you know, like I said, I don't know if it's because I had it for a, a much longer time. And all of these um, different in, uh, dupe houses, these are inspired. So these are their um, inspirations to the OG. And again, do, do Mula Mula. Is caramel, ginger, peach, caramel, raspberry, strawberry, vanilla, amber, laotian, oud, and patchouli. And I think that oud and patchouli is just like screaming from uh, Dua on my skin. Whereas with Dapper, it's more toned down and you're getting more of, I'm getting more of the sweet, the caramel. Yeah, I, I just can't. I can't do Dua. I, can, I can't do Dua. Um, yeah. I don't know, y'all. I can't do Dua. I think I might have to go back and get a small one from Dapper. And see, yeah, because that patchouli. Uh, I hate getting stuff with patchouli. And I just hope that cedar and patchouli is like, ugh. Because it never fails. 
that is just going to be screaming on my skin. Child, anywho, let me get up off of here. It's been 20 minutes. That is my review of Two Shot Caramel, Cotton Candy Milk, and Goddess Within Her. I forgot which one I sprayed. Did I spray Goddess Within Her? Something that smelled good. I forgot. Did I spray the kind of candy milk on me? I don't think I did. Yeah, the goddess. The goddess within her is mm, very nice. Very nice. As, as it's morphing on my skin, it's, it's just changing. Very nice. Uh, only one I'm, I'm happy with these two. But this one, I'm not liking it. Yeah, I like dappers much better. Again, it could be because it's been um, maturing over the past couple of months that I've had it. Um, but I'm ready to get rid of this now. Just give it to my husband. It is unisex. Um, yeah. So, anywho, y'all have a great rest of your week. And I'll get back with y'all on a better day. Peace. I wanted to add on P.S., as I am smelling the dapper Mula Mula uh, double caramel, as it's morphing, I do smell the fruity is coming through, like the strawberry, the raspberry, probably the peach all um, gelling together. Whereas Dua's, again, all I'm getting is that patchouli and that oud. And it's not good. So I just wanted to come back with that part um, of the video just to give y'all as this stuff is morphing on my skin. What I'm getting from Dapper versus Dua. Okay, bye y'all.